Welcome to this Extralis instructional video on the VESDA SensePoint XCL for Microball ASD system. Today we'll be showing how to replace a gas sensor. So the first thing we need to do with our SensePoint app is go to the maintenance menu. On the maintenance menu there's an option here, third one down, change sensor. We select this option. It advises us that it's going to put the detector in inhibit mode. So we said OK to that. And here it provides an instruction on what we need to do. So it's telling us we need to remove the sensor. So we will start by taking off the cap, the cover cap, which is a twist and pull. And then we'll use a Phillips screwdriver to remove the sensor housing. Once we've removed the sensor housing, we can now see the sensor inside. So we remove the sensor by pulling it upwards. Once everything is apart, we just follow the app and we click next. And the app tells us that we get our new sensor and we put our new sensor in. You just need to line the pins up. It's quite obvious when you put the sensor in. Sensor's now in, and we reverse the procedure of what we did before. Put the sensor cap back on. This notch goes into a notch there. Like that. Tighten it down with our Phillips screwdriver. Okay. Put our cap back on. Put it in a twist. And then we select next on the app. So the app's now telling us that the sensor is being initialised, which takes approximately one minute. So notice that the detector is in standalone mode and it's not connected to any tubing of the VESDA VEA detector. So now we follow the calibration procedure which is shown in another instructional video as prompted by the app. 